Hi there, my name's Mally, and you've tuned right back into Famished Foodie. Today, I'm in Victoria, located on Vancouver Island, and I'm going to be going to a place called Don Mee's, which is in Chinatown. As C and I are about to go into Don Mee's, I would like to thank my good friend Donna for recommending Don Mee's. We are so excited to try it out. What an amazing treat we have for you today. We have pork uh, dumplings. We have shrimp dumplings. We have beef meatballs. Beef meatballs. We have shrimp and scallops. And we've got ribs. So C is pointing to the shrimp dumplings. We also have chili sauce. And we also have I was going to hold up the, the tea. We also have some chili sauce. Mmm, nice and picante. We're Don't going to start, start without me, no matter how with much I know you want the shrimp dumpling. So here's the shrimp dumpling. Oh, it looks so good. Mmm, delicious. Mmm, look at this. Mmm. 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 Mm. Nice and big shrimp dumplings. And full of shrimpy flavor. Mmm. Delicious. See? What is your take? Not my personal favorite, but I can tell how it's like really nice for people who really like shrimp dumplings. Okay, so try other dumplings, please. I need some tea. <laughs> Okay, take some tea, and I'm going to have a pork dumpling. This that is what the pork, and I'm so hungry. And that um, is the pork dumpling, and let's try. Um. Mm. The pork is meaty. It's juicy, and the and the wrapper. Mm. Mine kind of fell apart. But it's kind of light and tasty and delicious. And I'm going to dip the pork in a bit of the chili sauce. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, this is good. Really meaty. Mm hmm So she really likes the pork dumplings. Mmm. They are delicious. Mm, let's try the shrimp and um, I just forget the name. Shrimp and scallop, scallop dumpling. Look at that. Look at that. It's a nice, light, scallopy taste. And then it's the shrimp dumpling, like the other shrimp dumpling. Mm. And I'm going to try it. Dip it in the chili sauce. Mm. Not my personal favorite. I don't like the taste of shrimp. Mm. I love the taste of shrimp, so it means more dumplings for me. So excited. Mm. What a good day. Yeah. See, is pointing at the meat. Nice meat. Mm -hmm. So let's try this. So this looks. Oh, so it has a bit of a wrapper underneath and more of a meat filling. And then I'm going to give. See, oh, it's kind of sticking in the plate. <laughs> and this is for C. And it looks like it's a bit warm. And it tastes kind of meaty. It tastes almost a bit gelatinous, but it's really kind of, it's a mild taste. It's, it's quite lovely. See? What is your taste? I was about to say, it's like mild meat taste, but I also don't have that many taste buds compared to my mom, so I could just be feeling like super mild. 
And last thing for this round that we're going to be trying is these yummy riblets in a black bean sauce. There's some fat on there. Mm. That has a nice light black bean taste. Mm. I still haven't perfected the art of taking the bone and putting it down. And now we're going to have the, what is this called again? Delicious. Okay. But this sesame is sesame seed red bean ball. That's right. This is a sesame seed red bean ball. Mm. I haven't had that in years, and I love it. And Rick, who I think is the owner of Don Me, is circling. He's saying hi. <laughs> it's been so wonderful. Circling all the dishes that C and I have had, and he's been so gracious and lovely. Mm. This, oh, my favorite. There's red bean on the inside and a coating and sesame seeds on the outside. I love it's actually it. actually kind of sweet. And the red bean is sweet, which is what I so love. It's a combination of crispy and sesame seedy and sweet. Mm. That's delicious. See? What are your thoughts? That is so good. Mm. Delicious. Now see? What what would you like to try next? The barbecue buns or the lotus leaf? So you would like to try next the lotus leaf. Mm, so this is what it looks like. And then when you peel back the lotus leaf, and the lotus leaf r rice things is mm -hmm. lotus leaf has a distinct smell to it. It has a very distinct smell, and it's like like savory and earthy. It's the really yummy. Yuffy? <laughs> yummy combination. Yuffy. 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 Yummy and lovey. Alrighty, so this is what it looks like on the inside. There's a bit of a pork and rice and a bit of mushroomy and see feed it to my mouth. Has their mouth open right now, saying, Ooh, feed it to me. C is excited and I'm going to scoop a bit more in here mm. for C. I'm gonna hand that over to C. And for me, look at this. Mm. So T, C, please start. Mm. I'm so excited about this. The rice itself is very mild, but also like mildly savory, but in like a really good way. That's right. And C, and I please think up. No, I think that's due to like the pork underneath all of it, giving it like a sort of like uh meaty sort of like texture to mm. delicious as he said the ma the rice is mild and the porky flavor has that beautiful touch of earthiness and yumminess mm. Mm. That is so delicious. It's savory. It's moorish. means you want more. It's yummy. It's like putting on a nice warm blanket on a cold day. It makes you feel good on the inside. The rice wow. is good. <laughs> the rice? <laughs> C's really liking the rice. And now we're going to try the barbecue pork buns, which I think C will love. <laughs> There's she. So excited. So, please take one seat. Do I eat it with my hands? Yes, you can take it with your fingers. Fingies. Okay. So, I'm also going to try it with my fingers. And this is what a pork bun looks like. And, it's, oh. <laughs> and this is, I'm, I'm, I'm assuming it's going to be a sweet barbecue pork flavor. It is sweet and savory. Mmm. Sweet and savory, delicious. Mm. There's a big table to our left. It's so wonderful seeing families come together and eat and laugh 
we spend time together as I'm doing with she. Oh, this is delicious. Well, as always, thank you so much for tuning in to Famished Foodie. We so appreciate it. Jesse? Have a, have a savory day. Have a savory day. If you ever come to Victoria, come and visit Don Lee's. They're such nice people, and the food is phenomenal. Remember to like and subscribe. And until next time, see you later. Bye.